Over on this table, we have the bare essentials, everything you will need to start your first sub-zero overclocking session. Over here, we have the liquid nitrogen, which will be your main cooling component, and you can throw it into a coffee flask or any kind of flask like this. And uh, let's start with the most important component you will need is the CPU container. You can order this online from kingpincooling.com, SF3D, or Durator, or Ryba. Just find someone and order one. You will get the mounting equipment with, and probably some insulation, but if you need to buy your own, you can buy this uh, insulation from any air conditioning or refrigeration shop in your country. Over here we have petroleum jelly or Vaseline which is a good sear, I'll go into that in the next video. Uh, some electrical tape, some paper towels, and thermometer to monitor your, monitor your temperature because liquid nitrogen has a lot of ranges and you need to find the one your CPU is most happy with. Most important is a K-type probe because it reads temperatures down to liquid nitrogen levels. Not essential but very uh, useful is a multimeter because some motherboards have read points like the Gigabyte UD5H and then you can just monitor your voltages if you need while you overclock. That is about all you need to have a first session and I will teach you how to do insulation in the next lesson.